start to spring. Fancy gloves, though, where so many heat So there's never, never a dream. Two apologies of accents. The first is 
for those of you that don't know, Sylvia and I have a brother, our brother David, who lives in Galway. David is too ill to travel, although we're fortunate enough to have his daughter Davina, my niece, with us today, and Sylvia's niece. Um, but David sends a message to Sylvia and Mitch. And the message is, sorry I couldn't be here, but Carmel and I wish both of you a very happy day, and we would love to see you both in Galway soon. The other message of apology I have is from the lovely Auntie Enos. Um, Auntie says hello to all her fans, and those that are yet her fans. She too is so sorry she couldn't be here today, but many of you know she had a very nasty fall on Monday and is not well enough to travel. We all know that Sylvia and Mitch were absolutely thrilled when Auntie was able to make the journey to Las Vegas and to give Sylvia away to Mitch. Auntie's message today to Sylvia and Mick is, if you are going to repeat this wedding for a third time, <laughs> I will be there no matter where or when. <laughs> so, a few words I wanted to say. Well, as you can imagine, I've been waiting many years to be at my sister's wedding. <laughs> but nothing happened. And then suddenly she has two in six weeks. <laughs> but that is typical of Sylvie. And those of you that know her, Sylvie doesn't do anything by halves. Well, you two, we've travelled to Las Vegas and now Glasgow to celebrate this marriage. But there is one further step. You both have to take before this marriage is truly cemented. And that is the traditional ritual of holding hands. If you come over to the table, please get your cameras ready.